traders have to keep their eyes on Washington and on Wall Street. Joining us now is Nick Santiago of In The Money Stocks. Nick, how are you handling so much information and news coming into the market at the same time? Well, right now we have so many things going on geopolitically, but the best way to, to handle anything is just to stick with the charts. And the trend is still up at this moment in time. Um, while that can change as things start to get a little bit parabolic, we are starting to see the Russell 2000, which has been a great leading indicator, and I've mentioned it here, um, that continues to make new highs. And as long as that's making new highs, I think things are okay. However, um, you know, we are getting a little bit frothy, a little bit high on the uh, totem pole there. So we want to be a little bit careful at this point in time. But all traders want to stick with the trend as long as they can. And right now the trend is still up. Nick, what's your trade of the day? Yeah, so my trade of the day right now, I like to buy things that are on sale, is going to be Hormel Foods. Ticker symbol is HRL. And uh, I'm looking for that to return a nice 15% from here. Can you tell us more about that setup? Yes, I just bought uh, Hormel Foods uh, right at this level, the 55 er uh, 45 area, and I think this could trade probably into the low to mid 50s. I'm going to give it a little bit of time, but this is a very, very good level, and it's one of the stocks that have not uh, taken off to the upside yet, as we've had so many equities uh, move significantly higher over in the last uh, two months. So this one looks like a good one, um, and I am in it. Thank you so much, Nick. You too. Thank you. For more Business First AM, check us out on social media. We're on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. And go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.